to Celebro for 755 here. And today we're here at the NRA um, Museum of Guns. So yeah, let's see what guns they have here. Mm -hmm. Already, as you can see, there's already guns in here. So yeah, let's see. Whoa, it's like a, it's like the, what do you call that sniper? This is like the Moscow. Oh, the Skink. Skinarts and Falch's bolt action double barrel rifle. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys, but it's so small. Did you know? Yeah, did you do a double take when you look at this rifle? Your eyes aren't fooling you. This is a this is both a double barrel and a bolt action repeating firearm. Radical is designed. This rifle loads two cartridges at the same time. Where? Where, where does this rifle... Oh, right there, see? The middle. Right there. Hmm, that's cool. Hello. Um, Radical and Design, this rifle loads two cartridges at the same time. And, and it is the world's only m magazine fed double rifle design. Oh, that's cool. So, this right here is the world's first... Well, world's only only um wait what yeah if i'm right world's only um double magazined rifle there are there are ejection ports on both sides of the frame to spit out brass to the right and left you know what, i'm not gonna read this all but that's cool Devil shotgun. It's a devil shotgun. That looks more like a musket. Okay, so okay, so let's see why they call it the devil shotgun. Nicknamed the devil shotgun, this raggedy crafted and cased 16 GA percussion shotgun won a medal at the 1849 Paris Exposition. It is. It is um. Embarrassingly emblazoned with numerous multicolored gold inla inlaid renderings of demons and other bizarre creatures. What? So it says it has strange creatures on it. Where? Where does this have creatures on it? That's cool though. Puppy. Puppy. Did, did you know this won an award in 1849? And it said like it had engolded renderings of demons and other bizarre creatures, along with the human victims. French rumor of the period sometimes involved private health issues in open discussion in, in the case of the use of a cloister syringe in several scenes. So this shotgun is called the Devil's Shotgun because it, ha it has the, and like, Embraided in it the like devil marks and all that like creatures and victims like you see over there in like the bottom you can see like a woman right there that's cool um whoa what is that that is the I'm sorry who guys but I can't zoom in while I'm recording so I'm sorry the glad the Galazian Winchester Model 21 shotgun. There's lots of shotguns on here. Dear Lord. Hmm. That's cool. Oh, that's cool. This is this shotgun right here. You can see it has the uh, uh, the um, Olympics. Wait, which one? Yeah, that one. The Olympic symbol right there you guys right about there my fingers touching it so it says the uh, remington sh under over under shotgun um 12 ga frank what does ga mean ga what does ga mean gauge gauge what is that? i don't see gauge. 12 gauge. ga ga gauge. Gauge. okay well gauge. now we found out that ga means gauge gold yeah, and garving la olympics 1985 not 84 Olympid case gun 20. Oh, in the NR, 
and the top one was also in the Olympics. It is the Anne Schwartz and Anna Schwartz bolt action rifle, the 22 cal, which caliber, represented to Robert E. Peterson in an Olympid Case Gun 19. Case 19. Hmm. Okay, that's cool. Anne Schwartz. Huh? Anne Schwartz. Mm -hmm. Manufactured all kinds of uh, firearms like that for uh, shooting for, tests. Shooting con contest. Oh, yeah. Well, okay. Thank you. Those that has the I believe the, the the shade is for the people who use the. Oh, hey, you know, that's cool. The believe that design for that, right? Yeah, yeah. That's cool. Right. The uh, Walter. This, this, uh, Robert Peterson was sweet for his hand. He was on the. Uh, Shooting committee for the okay. Olympics, so. Wait, so this is this Robert Peterson's jacket? Yeah. Mm, that's cool. So the <laughs> Pedersoil replica of M1806 flintlock pistol. Um, the 60 caliber presented to Robert Peterson as Olympic Commissioner, Olympad Case Gun 2029. And Robert E. Peterson, it says right there. The Walter OSP pistol, 22 short caliber. It It's a ca CA from 1961 to 1994. Olympic case gun, 27. Hmm, these are all, look at that gun over there. Oh, that's cool. Right, let's see what the rest of these shotguns are and guns. This is an, oh, by the name, Hermann Goring. This looks like something a Nazi used. Hermann. The swastika, it's called swastika. A swastika. Yeah, a swastika's right over there. This gun was used by a Nazi then. Berferling Karnilahem, Karnilahal. Julie, 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 1937, and, and Dank Barrick Hermann Goring. Hermann Goring, the Merkel 303 under, under, over, under shotgun, 20, 21, it's, eh, why am I messing up my words? 12 gauge, Cal, 1930s. Herman Welling Goring, 1893 to 1946, was an ace pilot in World War I. Oh, no, I was wrong. And, and what do you call it? And recipient of the poor Limiti Blue Max, he rose in the Nazi hier hierarchy to become head of the Luder Wharf in World War II. And Hitler's designated successor. successor. He was con convicted of war crimes at the Nuremberg trials, but committed suicide before he he could be executed. Hey, at least he didn't get executed a painful way. I mean, a shotgun's quick, but eh. he was com okay. So before this exception, shotgun was captured near the end of the war and presented to General of the Army Dwight D. Eisenhower, who. In turn, gave gave it to General of the Arms Joe Pershing, German case item one. Ooh! Oh my gosh! What is that? It's a revolver. It's a revolver. Wow, that's a strange revolver. Oh, there's a Colt M1911. That's cool. I'm so excited to see all these guns in World War Two. Called World War Two. Oh. <sighs> The Colt Python Revolver, uh, the very top one. Um, the 357 Magnum Caliber, Cal 1965, Robert Peterson's personal revolver showing use and wear, R.E. Peterson's Case Gun 2. Hmm, that's cool. Um, wow, just wow. Oh, we're... Were all these, were all these the dogs? Wait, are these all the dogs of the hunting games he used? There's that one. Th those are dogs. They may look like horses from a far away distance, but those are dogs. 
Oh no, okay. Okay, so, oh, okay. So look, Lynchy side-by-side -side shotgun, 12 gal, 1960 to 1980, engraved with Robert E. Peterson's Dog Storm, R.E. Case Gun 26. So probably by what I can guess, this dog died in a hunting, hunting, and so he was buried with this gun. So, dang, R.E. Peterson had all these dogs, and they, they were buried with this certain shotgun. Hmm, that's interesting. So, and then we have this right here, the Harrington and Richards, um, War Chester Mass. Mass. Hmm. Look at all those revolvers. The Ringing Gold Extra Dry Langer Beer. Hmm. Okay, so let's see what this is. Whoa, look at number three, you guys. Look at that small gun. This, this one here? Which one? It's a tiger. Oh, yeah, number six. Oh, God, I shouldn't put pressure on the on the thing. On the pistol. Really? It's a dagger? It's a brass knuckle? Oh, that's so cool. It's like a... It, it, there's a revolver part it's at the very end. Wait. The legs, a Apache pistol. Here, seven, let, me, let me Seven see millimeters. That. See that. The number six. All right, you guys. So it is number six. The Dow, the Dow, um, uh, the Dow Lehia Apache, 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 Apache pistol, seven millimeter 